struggle and the victory of an oppressed people. Mm -hmm. A treasury of inspiration. It is informational. It is an encouragement to and for the people of God. Mm -hmm. In this 150th number of the psalm, the poetic author or lyricist not only leads the congregation in praise, he pauses periodically and documents various reasons, undeniable evidence, mm -hmm. unforgettable experiences mm -hmm. that qualify him as an authority as worship leader. Mm -hmm. Scholars agree that this gifted individual who penned this praise mm -hmm. is none other than David himself. All right. Y'all know David. Uh -huh. David was an authority. He was the Old Testament poster boy mm -hmm. on restoration. Mm -hmm. He was a shepherd boy, a skilled musician. Mm -hmm. He was a bear whisperer. Mm -hmm. He was a lion's worst nightmare. Mm -hmm. He was good looking, mm -hmm. extremely wealthy. He was the Warren Buffett of ancient Israel. Mm -hmm. He was a statesman. He was a warrior. He was a brilliant military strategist. Mm -hmm. Yet he had a few flaws, as many of us. Among them, he was a womanizer and a murderer. But at the very top of his resume, he is celebrated and remembered as the apple of God's eye. All right. I see, I see. Note in this psalm how he states his case in specific clusters as he offers a recurring invitation to praise. Uh -huh. Praise, it is a critical matter in the life of the church. Uh -huh. yes, sir. Yes, sir. It is humanity's response to God's revelation of himself. All right. It is a theme of the scriptures. All right. Yes, sir. Praise comes from a Hebrew word which means to boast, mm -hmm. holel, to commend, mm -hmm. or to celebrate. Mm -hmm. Praise comes from a Latin word meaning value or price. All right. Yeah. Thus, to give praise to God mm -hmm. is to boast, it mm -hmm. is to commend, mm -hmm. it is to celebrate, mm -hmm. to causatively proclaim his merit or his worth. All right. Many terms are used to express this in the Bible, including glory, All right. blessing. Mm -hmm. Thanksgiving and Hallelujah, yeah. which is a transliteration of the Hebrew for praise the Lord. All right. Yes. Now, when you are able, what my praise leaders at? All right. Yes. When you are able to recognize the awesome presence of God, uh -huh. His very presence commands a praiseful response. All right. Yes. Unpack the text with me and mm -hmm. let us see that this text, mm -hmm. it is pregnant with preachative potential. All right. Today's society mm -hmm. is in major chaos. Mm -hmm. I dare not insult your presence in this sanctuary mm -hmm. by rehearsing the litany of utter disgrace in high places. All right. The lack of morality, the constant stream of scandalous national and international antics mm -hmm. and assorted misbehavior mm -hmm. in politics. Mm -hmm. I remind you that politics is a compound word. Poly mm -hmm. means many. Mm -hmm. Ticks are blood suckers. Uh huh. All right. All right. Yes, uh, uh huh. Uh huh. Lest I stray. Uh huh. Uh huh. I am concerned, however, uh -huh. about people who are in the Lord's house. All right. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. People whom God has blessed. Mm -hmm. I'm concerned about people whom God has been good to. Yes. Mm -hmm. People who are seemingly immune to worship. Mm 
and allergic to praise. Uh, mm. I've even heard some people who have the audacity to ask, does it really take all that? Uh, Why praise the Lord? Uh -huh. A better question would be, why not praise uh -huh. the Lord? Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. Praise honors the Lord. Yes, it does. Praise is commanded approximately 200 50 times throughout biblical writ, mm -hmm. we praise the Lord to appreciate him. Mm -hmm. I come to tell you, praise will protect your heart and your mind. Uh -huh. yes. In our text, we find a king who instructs us to praise the Lord. Uh -huh. He says in another place, delight thyself in the Lord. Mm -hmm. And he shall give thee the desires of thine heart. Mm -hmm. And then Pastor Paul's literary offering in 1 Thessalonians 5 verse 18 says, mm -hmm. In everything yeah. give thanks. Uh -huh. Not for everything, no. but in, in everything. everything. Yeah. For this is the will of God in yeah. Christ Jesus concerning you. Uh -huh. I want you to know, my brothers and my sisters, the mm. true spirit of being godly is being able to stand when life is at its worst uh -huh. and to rejoice under all circumstances. Yeah. Uh -huh. Come on back here for a moment, Paul, uh -huh. and remind us what you said in Philippians 4 and 4. Uh-huh. Yeah. Rejoice in the Lord always. Yeah. And again I say rejoice. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, beloveds and friend of mine, observe, it is our duty and privilege mm -hmm. to rejoice in God. Yeah. And to rejoice in Him always. Yeah. Mm -hmm. To rejoice in Him at all times, in all conditions. Mm -hmm. Even when we suffer for him or when we are afflicted by him, All right. there's no need for Christians to go through life fretting and complaining about the cataclysmic impact of trials and tests mm -hmm. from God. Uh -huh. No Christian man, woman, boy, or girl mm -hmm. will go through this life unscathed. Uh -huh. Hung down heads, moaning and groaning is not the way to prove the depth of your relationship with God. Uh -huh. I remember the day when saints used to think, the more pitiful I can look, mm. the more pitiful I can talk and uh -huh. act, uh -huh. the more saved I am. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. However, the real proof of a Christian's life uh -huh. Is his or her ability to face life and all of its realities with faith, mm -hmm. courage, and joy. Uh -huh. yeah. We are admonished to rejoice mm -hmm. in the Lord always, always. Yeah. and to show a cheerful attitude uh -huh. even in the midst of our crisis. Yes, yeah. Fix yourself up. All right. Yeah. Put a smile on your face. Yeah, yeah. Put some pep in your step yeah, yeah. and earn your testimony. Yeah, yeah. Job would tell us, though he slay me, yeah. Yeah. yet will I trust, trust him. him. Yeah. The word rejoice has come down to us through the centuries. Mm -hmm. Come here, Isaiah. Uh. I will greatly rejoice in the Lord. Mm -hmm. My soul shall, for he hath clothed me with the garments of salvation. Uh -huh. He hath covered me with the robe of righteousness. Yeah, uh -huh. Come here, Joel. Yeah, yeah. Be glad, ye children of Zion, uh -huh. and rejoice in the Lord your God. Yes. For he hath given you the former rain moderately. Mm -hmm. And he will cause to come down for you the former rain and the latter rain uh -huh. in the first month. Yeah. Come here, Habakkuk. Uh -huh. Yet I will rejoice in the Lord. Uh -huh. I will joy in the God of my salvation. Uh -huh. 
The Bible says, let the redeemed of the Lord say so. Y'all so. yeah. uh -huh. gonna make me mess my hair up All in right, here. Rejoice, Rejoice evermore. Yeah. Rejoice before the Lord mm -hmm. thy God. Make a loud noise mm -hmm. and rejoice. All right. Sing and rejoice with unspeakable joy. Yeah. Let the heavens be glad and let the earth rejoice. Yeah. Let them that seek the Lord rejoice. Uh -huh. Rejoice in the Lord, all ye that fear him. Uh -huh. You ought to know by now, Cornerstone, that we have a right. And we have a reason yeah. to rejoice. Yeah. Uh -huh. We ought to be glad and rejoice uh -huh. when we come together to worship. That's right. We ought to be able to shout about the Lord's goodness yeah. and rejoice in his salvation. Yeah. Uh -huh. We ought to make some joyful noise yeah. uh -huh. about the goodness of the Lord. Yeah. Yeah. Rejoice in the Lord's uh -huh. saving grace. Yeah. Rejoice in the Lord's mercy. Uh -huh. Rejoice in the Lord's love. Uh -huh. Rejoice in the Lord's truth. Yeah. Rejoice in the Lord's loving kindness. Yeah. Rejoice in the Lord's faithfulness. Uh -huh. Finally today, uh -huh. as we draw towards conclusion, yeah. don't want to hold you too long. Uh -huh. In this last psalm, mm -hmm. Verse 1 tells us where we are to praise. Uh -huh. yes, praise God mm -hmm. in his sanctuary. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Verse 2 tells us what we are to praise. Uh -huh. yeah. We are to praise his mighty acts uh -huh. and praise his excellent greatness. Yeah, yeah. Verses 3 through 5 tell us mm -hmm. how we are to praise. Uh -huh. Praise him, the psalmist says, uh -huh. with every conceivable and available instrument. Uh -huh. And then finally in verse 6 mm -hmm. tells us who is authorized to praise. Uh -huh. Let every created being yeah. uh -huh. that has spirit. Yeah. Let every created being yeah. that has life yeah. praise the Lord. Yeah. I've got to go, y'all. Right, praise him yeah. for his ability. Yeah. Uh -huh. Praise him yeah. for his attentiveness. Yeah. Yeah. Praise him yeah. for his anointing. Yeah. Praise him yeah. for his Yes, Praise him yes. for his blessing. Yes. Praise him yes. for his correction. Yes. Praise him yes. for his compassion. Yes. Praise him yes. for his direction. Yes. Praise him yes. for his deliverance. Yes. And praise him for his death. Praise him for his empathy. Praise him for his forgiveness. Praise him for his faithfulness. Praise him for his favor. Praise him for his goodness.
Is there anybody here that's going to help me praise? Come on, let's praise our way out of 2018 and praise our way in to 2019. I got to go, y'all. But back home, back home, back home, they called me Holland Harris. <laughs> I said they called me Holland Harris. I got to 